Here we go. This shit is dangerous. <laughs> Welcome to my apartment. Okay, let's jump right into this apartment tour. The first thing we have is a big ass cactus or cacti. Cacti is too, right? Okay, anywho, this is the kitchen slash living room area. I did make some sacrifices in, in this apartment. I did want like a bigger living room area with the TV. That would have been nice, but as you can see, I did not get that. Um, I also did not get a patio or terrace. Um, those things were not super duper high on my list, but I did get some of the other things that I wanted, okay? So actually the other day I had some um, girls over. We were just sitting, talking, drinking, and there was actually no need for the TV because we talk so much, all right? So yeah, this is the kitchen area. So sink, uh, stove top, which I also have a question for you guys because I was at a house party the other day and we had a debate. It was the Southerners, there, well, there aren't many of us, but there was the Southerners versus the Floridian and the New Yorkers. Um, what do you guys call these things, okay? Um, they call them burners, but in the South, we call them eyes. So there are two eyes on the stove, okay? So just curious what you guys call them. Um, but by the way, all the uh, utensils, the glassware, the plateware, um, everything that you see basically came with the apartment. Um, even the dish soap came with the apartment. I did buy my own sponge, but yeah, everything uh, came with it. Um, microwave and there is no oven, <laughs> which I realized like a couple of days ago, I didn't realize there wasn't an oven. Um, another thing too, that this only has like cold room temp water. It doesn't really have hot water, which is something that I learned from the super the other day. He said that is common in Mexico. I don't know if it's common in Mexico or if it's just common in this apartment building, but anywho, there is no hot water to wash dishes, which is kind of mind blowing. Um, but the good thing about this location um, is that I am close to a Korean market. So I'm getting all of my Korean snacks. I literally have not had this since early 2018. So I was really excited to see this. Got my soju as always. Um, oh, and I showed my friend this the other day. We met in Korea and she thinks that this is absolutely disgusting, but I used to eat this all the time when they had this in the school cafeteria. Um, I don't know if anyone recognizes it, but it's like little dried fish. <laughs> so I enjoy it. I enjoy it. It's kind of weird, but, um, I like that. All right, so that's pretty much the kitchen, you know? Um, nothing much else to say about that. So full-length mirror, which I absolutely love. So, you know, you can check yourself um, when you're going out on the town. Oh, and all the artwork came with the apartment. I'll try to get it where it doesn't have a glare, but this is actually my favorite uh, picture in the entire apartment or photo. But this is the Angel of Independence. So this is the Angel of Independence back in the day. And this is the angel of independence today. Okay, so same, same, but different, right? So yeah, man, I wish I knew when this photo was taken. Okay, so that is that. I also want to make note of these doorways, the archways. I absolutely love them. And I also love the colors. So with uh, the wood kind of brightens things up and the natural light brightens things up, but I am in love like with these dark colors that's just me all right so next room is the bedroom okay big fake plant which is absolutely fine with me i would probably kill anything like the cactus may survive of course but anything else i might kill it so um this when i saw this on the wall okay like i absolutely fell in love with this room so we're gonna give this some attention okay this is your life do what you love and do it often. If you don't like something, change it. If you don't like your job, quit. If you don't have enough time, stop watching TV. If you are looking for the love of your life, stop. They will be waiting for you when you start doing things you love. Stop over analyzing. All emotions are beautiful. Life is simple. When you eat, appreciate every last bite. Open your mind, arms, and heart to new things and people. We are united in our differences. Ask the next person you see what their passion is and share your inspiring dream with them. 
Travel often. Getting lost will help you find yourself. Some opportunities only come once. Seize them. Life is about the people you meet and the things you create with them. So go out and start creating. Life is short. Live your dream and share your passion. Y'all, I second all of this. Okay, I second all of that. All right. Um, fan, which circulates the entire apartment. Okay. And then the thing behind it is apparently the heater, which... I have not touched at all. Um, TV. So TV came with the apartment. I've just been watching Breaking Bad with Spanish subtitles. Like that's all I've been doing and listening to some videos on YouTube. My Little Tortuga, which I absolutely love. And there is also plenty of storage space. There's even storage space um, like under the bed. So they did a really, really good job with that. Okay. Um, yes, let's go to the next room, which was also very, very important because I spent a lot of time in here, the bathroom. So guys, this shower, as soon as I saw the shower, I really didn't need to see anything else. I mean, the apartment ain't but so big, but <clears throat> yeah, definitely was the biggest thing for me. As you can see, so this shower filter, um, I actually asked them to install this. They paid for it, it was like 400 pesos, and they installed it like before I moved in here. So they were super duper helpful with that. And they're also going to put a washing machine in here as well. So yeah, that's pretty much that um, on my nail polish because that's my self-care situation that I have going on and I save money by doing my own nails. Um, I brush my teeth with bottled water, which I told you guys that before. So most things I do, um, I do pretty much either with bottled water or in the shower. I just usually wash my hands with the unfiltered water. That's about it. Um, and then I'm just gonna show really quickly because of one uh, girl did ask on Instagram recently, but I got this from Sally's and I've been using this on my twist outs. So I've been practicing, experimenting with my hair. Like I told you guys, um, believe it or not, I think it's actually doing pretty well um, in this Mexico City uh, weather. Okay, so yeah, that is the full apartment tour. Let me tell you guys a bit more about it. Let me get into some better light here. Okay. Let's talk about the price. Now in the last video, people were like, oh, you didn't mention the prices, but I didn't mention the prices for a reason um, because I showed two Airbnb apartments and then I showed an apartment that I looked at. Um, but the Airbnb apartments, you know, those come with fees. And what I've been finding, uh, actually my own experience and a lot of people that I've been talking to, they find their apartments through Airbnb, but then they negotiate off of the site. So a lot of the owners are understanding that Airbnb comes with these extra fees and that if you are willing to stay alone, longer term stay, they are willing to work with you. Okay. I found that a lot actually. And so that's actually uh, how I found this apartment. This wasn't through Airbnb, but I found the guy through Airbnb and then he showed me another apartment that they had. And so I'm so glad that I did that um, or else I wouldn't have found this place. Okay. So I am paying 950 US dollars for this apartment. Um, I know you're supposed to negotiate down, but I actually kind of like bid it up on this place because there was another person looking and I wanted her to kick rocks. And so I increased the price and then she wanted me to kick rocks. And so she increased the price. Um, but luckily there was no type of bidding war or anything like that. I only increased the price once, but they chose my offer because I had the longer term stay. So I... I'm very, very thankful for that, okay? Uh, and included in that price is the uh, Wi-Fi, the utilities. Uh, I get cleaning service once a week. Um, I can take out my trash and just put it like right outside the door every day and there's daily trash pickup. As far as security goes, there are security cameras, the front door locks, and then the adjacent building does have like 24 hour uh, reception service. So someone is always there. Um, so I feel very secure in this place. Also the cleaning woman is very, very thorough, okay? so. Um, um, I'm not used to having a cleaning person, so I was actually like trying to clean before she got here, which I guess, I don't know. But um, yeah, so I was washing the dishes and all that kind of stuff. And then when she got here, she started drying the dishes. And I was like, you know, you don't have to do all of that, but she does everything, um, changes out the sheets. Um, I get new sheets, new comforter, new um, pillowcases, all of that. So they have all of that here and they're switching everything out for you. Um, yeah. 
very very thorough okay and like i said the people are very very nice uh there is an apartment manager and that's kind of who showed me the place first and that's who i was dealing with in order to lease the apartment um he is very very responsive there's also a super who we have a bit of a language barrier going on but he's always smiling and we're always just like trying to figure it out together um yeah so the people have made this a very uh very very comfortable experience as well so i'm very thankful for that okay so yeah that's the apartment that's pretty much all i have to say about that if you guys have any questions comments suggestions about anything that you saw in this video um please drop them in the comment section below make sure you check out the description box for any additional links okay um there's some important information there so make sure you guys check that out follow me on instagram at jasmine t underscore tv if you want to keep up with my daily life things okay i see all these things floating um, I guess maybe we didn't dust. <laughs> so anywho, uh, we'll figure that out. So yeah, make sure you follow me on Instagram at jazzpatee underscore TV. I hope you guys enjoy your Sunday. I'm going to get myself together now and enjoy Mexico City. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.